Yep, that's me. You're probably wondering how I ended up in this situation. Look on this. I probably walk, and this is for walking mode. Basically, that's how you use. You press this button, and it will help you to walk. That's when you use it. I decide not to write here because I don't know the condition of it, but it helps a lot. Now I can ride it. And this bicycle is great for off-road because the pedals position higher from the ground so it does not touch the ground on the turns and so on so it's very good for snow most likely if you're riding on different terrain or sand I can see ocean now I notice when you're going down hills or when you don't use a throat or pedal assist the speedometer will be off you can see all zero because it will only activate it when you use pedal assist or when you use a throat that's something I don't really like I like to know what speed I'm going but it does not show me the speed Wow, it's a steep hill over here 
and it made it all the way up with pedal assist. Okay, there's ocean. All right, it was great experience riding up to this hill, uh, very uh, pleasant, and I can say it does very well in the hills area. So if you live in San Francisco or any, if you're planning to ride off-road, this is a great bicycle you can put in your trunk, depending on the size of the car, of course. Or even if you don't plan to fold, you can fold it in your house, so it will take less place. So it's a very good foldable bicycle very affordable for 750 watt power i think uh, it does very well for the mountains as you could see um, also the brakes i uh, first i thought okay mechanical brakes might be not as good because um, i have a different bicycle with uh, hydraulic uh, hydraulic costs more of course uh, and um, this one have mechanical brakes and if you're picking a uh, difference between hydraulic and mechanical I learned something from it. Uh, mechanical is much easier to adjust, also it's much cheaper to maintain. And with hydraulic brakes, it uh, costs about $35 to uh, maintain them. To, if you need to, you need to do like some um, maintenance once in a while. Also, sometimes they might just stop working if you don't do maintenance or if you need to bleed them so mechanical works really good and it's much cheaper and also it works uh, without much maintenance you just need to change your pads once in a while it depends on your riding uh, conditions and how long you ride but so far the bicycle is great for the mountains looks beautiful I am at uh, Topanga mountains all the way on the top Today it's not windy, which is great. You can hear a lot of birds. So get yourself a bicycle, mountain bicycle or flat tire bicycle for all terrain so you can go anywhere you want to. Thank you guys for watching and I'll see you in the next video. See you later.